or something, just some surprise effects. Yet, you know what I'm so upset about? What? I didn't make my background the one where you get inspiration from reading the books. Oh, no. Yet, I compulsively read every single book because those random ones that give you shit or start quests. Also, we've been streaming for about 20 seconds. Okay. <laughs> you can keep Sorry. talking about Bald- No, no, you can keep talking about Baldur's Gate. Change barista? Well, like, no, I am me, and I will stay me. I'll let you do your intro and stuff, and I have to- I don't really Pull care your that stream much. up. I'm not gonna lie. Deck. I don't really care that much about intros. Ah, <laughs> uh, gotcha. Or, I, I only mainly do- I only mainly just say, Hi! Welcome to game! Okay, let's go. And that's usually about it. So, hi! Welcome to Coffee Talk 2. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay. Oh, are you streaming on Discord? It should be. Yeah. Okay. Am I wrong? I don't know. It's been no. a week since no. I've had this conversation. But, well, I was ecstatic at the time. Forget everyone's voice, oh god. They are one of my favorite publishers, after all. Right. But... Not not to break the non-disclosure agreement or anything. Ah, uh, who needs an NDA anyway? What are they really gonna do? Sue you into oblivion? Probably. The terms weren't too great. Ooh. I'm sure you can rediscuss. Yeah. That's what, uh, Myrtle is wanting them to do. So you do- how did I do her voice? Oh, no. I remember one of their voices because I made him purposely annoying, I think. So, but not her. I actually really like her, so I didn't want her voice to be annoying. So you yeah. do get it. Is that it? No. No. I don't know how to do orc voices. It always feels weird when I do orc voices because it feels like I'm being offensive to someone. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I know what you mean. So you do... So, so how do I do, like, a feminine voice that's deeper? Because that's how I imagine her sounding. You want to pull up your last clip of them? I... Or... If I, I don't know if listening to myself will help, because I will sound different to me than how I sound to oh, me. Does that make sense? That's true. Yeah. Yeah, I know what you mean. So you do get it. I think that's close. Yeah, kind of. And by the way, you haven't signed any NDA yet, so you're not bound to anything. That is true. That's true. Yeah, so they can't yeah. legally sue you into oblivion. Yeah. Come on, Drac. You play Warcraft. You can you can do an orc voice. I don't play Warcraft. <laughs> what made you think I play Warcraft? Wow, Video City just coming in with the stream snipe. Not that I like hate Warcraft or anything. But but I still want to act in good faith. There are orcs in both Warhammer and Warcraft. What for? The terms were the furthest thing from acting in good faith. If I may ask, what terms are we talking about here? I'm sorry, I'm just a bit lost. Right, right. sorry about that. I mean, if I'm gonna participate in your private lives, I might as well at least get all the information. Yeah. Are there any in My Little Pony? What, NDAs? Orcs? I don't know. I've never seen My Little Pony. I know there's a weird dragon hybrid thing that's a bad guy, but not a bad guy? I don't know. Ah, eh, that's just Discord. There's no orcs in My Little Pony. Sum it up. I can't remember if you read that or not. I did. Okay. Sum it up, they're going to invest in the game and cover all the necessary expenses. Alright, that sounds like good. 
They'll do the marketing, promotion, distribution, and all that. Okay, sounds pretty great. Yeah. But if I'm unable to meet the deadline or refuse to adhere to the requests for changes, or breach any of the stated agreements in the contract, Many of which are rather questionable. I can't get my hair to do what I want. I must return all of their money regardless of my progress on the game. That Ooh, seems... that's not so great. Yeah, that seems kind of insane. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. I wouldn't go for that either. Because, <laughs> like, it's my game. One of the many reasons why I haven't really gone corporate with this whole twitch and youtube thing because yeah if they ask me to make changes i'm probably gonna tell them no <laughs> yeah there's a lot of game companies or some of that they used to do right? or some that's considered a bad term is if you don't adhere to their changes or you break any of this stuff instead of requiring all of their money back they'll say that they own your game now and like kick you out of it Yep. The only orcs I know about are in Skyrim and Baldur's Gate. Well, what? It won't be cheap at all, mind you. I can only imagine. It, if I fail to do so, they'll have full ownership of the game. Yeah, or shit like yep. this. I don't know what to say. That can't be right, can it? So what if they are the ones who breach the contract? I get to keep my game. Okay. That's it? Oh, no, that's not all. I'll have to return any of the unused investments too. What? That's what I said. Pardon me, but are they for real? I said that too. There's still plenty more, but uh... It's alright. I think I got the gist of it. When I first read it, I thought... Maybe terms are this way because it's still a draft. I suppose, yes. I also thought maybe it was something that could still be worked out and discussed. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, like... That is, until I asked Merton for advice. I see. It's a trash contract, Aqua. I know, I get it, but it's just, I just kept thinking, you know? What if this is how all the contracts are? That's not a good way to think about it. It won't be. <laughs> Take it to Bungie, they're usually chill with their employees, at least now anyway. So, <laughs> I'm sure they'll help you make your game. <laughs> yeah. What if this is the best I could get? Then go indie. Do it yourself. Fuck everyone else. Just don't use Unity. It's not, though. But what if? Will you still help me, Myrtle? Or not? I saw that eye roll. Is that really what's important here? Right now? Come on, Aqua. I know you're not this dense. Wow. Ow. <laughs> Damn. It would be nice if you heard what I'm actually saying and not what you think I'm saying. What do you mean by that? Sorry. Just a second. Oh. I I think I better go. 
I have to help prepare a report for a presentation tomorrow. All right. Are you going to be okay? Yes, I think so. How about you, Myrtle? I think I'll stay. Oh. Okay. Then, I'll see you around, Jack. Bye, Masako. Safe trip home. Ah, yes. The prankster. Are you alright? Yeah. This gets... I just got so frustrated when she kept asking me hypothetical question. Hypothetical question. Such as... She asked if I'd still be willing to help. Did she accept something like this in the future? What kind of question even is that? As if she doesn't trust me. Or anything I say for that. I don't think it's because she doesn't trust you or your expertise. From her perspective, everything feels like a potential chance. Though, to be faced with a questionable contract like that... Her favorite publisher, no less. You may very well be... Feeling a little shaken up. <laughs> That's a good point. I gave them- I gave them similar voices. I know that for a fact. Yeah. But I'm with her, right? I'm back. Did we beat the game? No, Video City. No. We did not. He has nothing to worry about. Er, wait, no. He has nothing to worry about. Even though she may still worry. If she's that worried, why don't you just say something like, Of course I'll help, but only if the terms aren't so crappy. That should do it, right? <laughs> Unless you did that and she's not convinced, then I don't know. <laughs> oh no! Thought... If I tell her that... She decides to go ahead with it anyway. I know for a fact I won't be able to refuse her at that point. Whoa. See? I'm just say yes! <laughs> Besides, we already agreed to start to only work on the game when we have the time, so... Basically, you're not sure you want to commit. You talking? Of course, it's not that. Things change when you start involving money in anything. Well, can't really argue with that. Remy, what are you doing? Remy's waiting for their turn to speak. <laughs> 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 I, I keep getting gifted subs for different channels, <laughs> and they all have glow stick waving, like, yeah, from, like, my star I'm gonna, anime. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, glow, I'm gonna get, like, a glow stick rave bat one at some point. It's gonna be great. Okay, it will be. Yeah, honey, come here, look. This is all the little glow stick rave people. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were trying to land a plane. <laughs> <laughs> the only In thing my I have chat, that big really? to land is my editing. <laughs> I know how some of these companies work. Ah, I lost your voice. I was doing good with it. It's okay, you got distracted by me trying to land the punchline. <laughs> we're looking for ideas from sm from the small guys. And find ways to pluck things they want from the project, then trash the rest. No respect for the effort whatsoever. That publisher may be one of her favorites, but that doesn't mean they're a good company. Especially with that garbage contract. 
Really shows what they truly are. Right? Really like working around the game. I honestly do. I love hearing what she wants to tell with her game. We're also not bound by some brand company rules or anything. The brainstorming ways to incorporate our ideas into the game is interesting and more enjoyable. A good change for what I do during the day as a game designer. Right. This is all I can say at the moment. You know, when you first meet Myrtle in the first game, she's very, very quiet. She doesn't talk hardly at all. It's not until Aqua gets involved that they actually start to, 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 she actually opens up. Just yeah, it seems understand. like. I'm just worried. About her. All valid reasons. I'm totally listening and not doing other things. I promise. Keep talking. This is coffee talk. <laughs> yeah, Drac is right. Though, I wonder. Did you say any of that to your pal at all? What? Why would I do that? Why would you not do that? Not to be creepy or anything, but when I overheard you guys, it's creepy. Right, sorry. So, me being creepy aside, obviously you thought a lot about this. But like, all you talked about was how dumb the contract was. And not any of what you just said. Whew. If I were in her position, I'd feel pretty bummed too. Because I'd be wondering if my partner still had my back, you know? Like, do they even care at all? It sounds like the project is her baby. Just like you said, working relationships don't mix well. So, it wouldn't be f too far out if she worries all the... Oh, damn it. So, it wouldn't be too far out if she worries about all the same stuff you do. Right? I imagine that's how he says right. With that, like, huh, 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 sort of feel to it, you know? Yeah. <laughs> now, having said that, I feel even more like an ass about what happened yesterday. I'd say it really, really is 2020, huh? I guess it can come off that way. I just thought it would be a given she understand where I came where I'm coming from. Maybe I'm taking things wrong. It's me who didn't trust her. And I just didn't want things to change. Embarrassing. Some friend I am, huh? I'm pretty sure you two sleep in the same bed. I think you're beyond friends at this point. I'm leaving. Okay. Hey, I hope everything will turn out well. What? You What's can up? be friends. There's just some benefits. <laughs> I said beyond friends. I didn't say they did. I didn't say they weren't still friends. Just beyond friends. Does that make sense? Relationships yeah. are weird. Doing good. <laughs> Thanks, Video City. I, why can't I see the times? What happened to everything? Why can I not see? Dear fucking god. Can't see when people say things. Okay. Here, I can probably fix that. Why are you giving me tasks? View unbanned request. Fuck your unbanned request. Someone no requested to be unbanned? Yeah. Probably. Was it the I'm gonna bot? just ignore them. No, it was an actual ah. it's actual people. That appearance. Timestamp for new messages. Yes. That helps. It's 8.30 p.m. I can do timestamps so that helps. Nah, it's fine. I figured it out. 
Yeah, beyond Here, friends. Just... There you go. They're beyond friends. Oh. <laughs> I Did it work? It. Did it give it a timestamp? Yeah, I don't know why it reset. That's weird. My entire, like, OBS setup reset. Well, not the entire thing, just my docs. So I don't know what's going on. Might have, like, had an... Twitch might have, like, had a website update or something and it fucked with everything. Probably what it was. We'll see. Have a safe journey home. It's very wet out there. Try not to die. Yep. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, bye. I didn't say that in the right voice. Yeah, you said that in a very awful voice. Woo! What a night. I didn't get anything done at all. That's too bad. Was that like a regular currency or something? You would be surprised. <laughs> Not yeah. them specifically, just like, not them specifically, just like, in general. Well, you seem used to it. So that answer is definitely yes, right? Not all the time, but often enough. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's the real reason why this place is called Coffee Talk, huh? You make people talk. I do? Well, it feels like this whole place does. Heck, even I talk about myself a lot more than usual. Which is kind of weird. But also weirdly cathartic. I'll take that as a compliment, I think. <laughs> you should. It's a feature. I reckon there's more benefits to talking things out without having to get smashed without having to get smashed first. You mean like drunk? Yeah. Okay, yeah, it's best to talk things out sober. More embarrassing to remember, sure. But great for self-reflection. That's a good point. Anyhow, before I forget, if you hold on to something for me, huh? A fidget spinner with a social media handle printed in on its back? Fidget spinner? Fidget My spider? old business card. If the lady from yesterday comes again, could you give that to her? I <laughs> forgot. We got the kids to say smashed. I just say wasted. <laughs> yeah. You mean Miss Madonna? <laughs> Getting bent. <laughs> so stupid. You know, there's this really what? old name for weed called Jive, and I want to bring that back. I want to call weed Jive again. In college, uh, it was blackout. Reefer. Yeah, no, that's still a thing. Blackout's still a is thing. It? People still say that. Yeah. Blackout okay. drunk is when you drink so much that you literally stop being conscious. Oh, I'm very familiar with blackout drunk. It, uh... It, I was taught if you're not blacking out, you're not drinking. I think that's incorrect. <laughs> because yeah, I can get absolutely... <laughs> I can get absolutely shit-faced, but I I can stop myself from going blackout. I know where my limits lie. That's the joys of getting blackout drunk on your 21st birthday. Anyway. Yeah, Miona. I mean, I owe her an apology. Nah, getting bent happens later. Shut up. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I mean, I owe her an apology, you know? And I couldn't find her online with just her first name, if that's even her real name. I thought maybe you could pass that along with my info to her so she can DM me. Also, in this form, it's less likely to get thrown out, yeah? That is a good point. Right? It really depends on the person. I don't like fidget spinners. I think they were a stupid friend. For yeah, content. but it's... Oh. Yeah, I got things to put in my drawer. Ooh. What were you saying? Oh, um... It's just harder to, like, throw... Like, you look at it for, like, a split second more if it's something big and bulky instead of just some business card before yeah. throwing it out. 
That is true. Because you're like... As... Go ahead. Oh, no. I was done. Sorry. As far as, like, business stuff goes, it I do... I can definitely see it being a lot better to hand somebody, like, an actual object rather than, like, a card. Because with an object, you know... Ah, why is TikTok open? Fuck off. Because with the card, you know, just it usually just ends up getting stuffed down somewhere and forgotten about. But if it's yeah. something that people can, like, actively play with, then hey, look at that. Business model is being spread and people are enjoying your business model. Or your business name. So all of a sudden it's everywhere. Yeah, and then they go to order another one. Yeah. When it breaks. And lo and behold, they find all this other stuff. Yeah. I, or something like that. I anyway. will say, yeah, I will say, though, that Lucas makes a point about, like, you know how they were saying you in the game draws people out and makes them talk more? Yeah. Being on your stream talking, like, is the most I've ever talked about myself in, like, a very long time. Yeah, uh, well, streams are good for that in general, honestly. I'm kind of bad at Fair it. Point. Unless somebody else was here. Then it makes it easier. Yeah. Or if there's other characters that I can kind of bounce off of. Which I guess is kind of what streaming is. I think RPGs would be better, though. That's is this fair. an RPG? Maybe. Oh. Uh... It is a role-playing game, so... I am technically... Technically, yeah. I mean, wouldn't you technically... Wouldn't every game be a role-playing game at that point? Because in every single video game, you're playing some kind of role. True. But unless you're literally assuming a role of a... Coffee shop owner? Business tycoon. Yeah! There we go. <laughs> you're just playing an advanced version of Roblox. Let's be honest here. <laughs> Every game is Roblox. <laughs> there you go, Video City. Every game is Roblox. Streaming an RPG where you're a streamer streaming an RPG. It's just, it's literally just YouTuber Tycoon. That's a game that exists and I hate it. Yeah. PewDiePie Simulator. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think she'll throw it away? Honestly, I can't really say. I'm just a cut. I'm just a barista. No, oh, now you're making me nervous. Can you give it back? I might need it right now. Eh, uh, sure. No, it's fine. Keep it. I need to keep my resolve. How about writing down your email instead? I feel a bit more personal that way. You think so? I think she'd be more comfortable about contacting me if it's less personal. Wait, no, wait. I thought that was me for some reason. I thought she'd... I thought she'd be more comfortable about contacting me if it's less personal. Well, I don't know Roblox. I play with real Legos. You know what? That's fair. Yeah, Mega Bloks. There, I'm pretty sure you could go to certain cities and get shot for saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Just you get two rival gangs in like fucking I don't want to say places where gangs are actually notorious. <laughs> the Lego World place. You, you, you go to like you go to like New Orleans or something, and there's two rival gangs there. The Legos and the Mega Blocks. All their weapons hey, are made I... out of their respective locks. <laughs> Legos may hurt more, but Mega Blocks are big, bulky, break easy, but they're also the only ones to ever partner with Halo. You know what? That's fair. And I did love buying those little figurines. I would never buy any of the kits. I would just buy the like little like five dollar packs of figurines that they had, and I would take them Same, home and play with them. That's what I did. Video <laughs> City's in here cussing me out. <laughs> Remy, he didn't cuss you out. He just said, "Shut up." Oh, it started. <laughs> it, 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 Twitch yeah. says you sent me a hostile message. <laughs> That's Here, true. I didn't even Twitch. play Halo. I was jealous. <laughs> Thanks, Video City. 
<laughs> Thanks for proving Mega Bloks are better. Sponsored by Video City. <laughs> That's why I figured her DMing me would be better. But then again. Hmm. Nah, you're right. A direct line would be better here. But what if she throws it away? At least you'll have sincerely tried. Do that. All right. I'll trust your judgment, Drac. Oh, God. A piece of paper with Lucas's Tomodacho username and phone number written on it. An influencer contact info for certain someone. That's... Oh, I have to make choices? In that case, could Ooh. you please give it to her when the time seems right? If she even comes back, that is. In Starfield, you're just a reincarnated dragonborn playing a space pirate struggling with carrying capacity as always. <laughs> ah, Bethesda, you and your games. I can cuss you out with hostility and that'll make you feel better, he also says. Oh wait, no, that was you who responded. I'm an idiot. You're, both your names are orange on my screen, okay? It's weird. Oh god, that is weird. Well, I'll see what I can do. Alright, sweet, thanks. You're the best. Here, I'll, re I'll reload. Maybe it'll change my color. Oh man, that evil Dr. Regman is really kicking up a storm out there. I thought his voice sounded from I thought the voice I gave him sounded familiar. It's Sonic. I gave him Sonic's voice. <laughs> I better go before the rain uh -huh. gets worse. It's a good thing I can literally dodge raindrops. See you around, Drac. Don't work too hard, okay? Thanks. Safe trip. <laughs> oh no. Take care. <laughs> Found Sonic's voice great. It's easy to do. Why is Sonic's voice so easy for me to do? Woo, what a day. Detox tea. Super bitter, sour, and spicy. Even if it's not detoxifying, you'll feel as if it is. I don't want to... <laughs> I... Okay. I feel like you're going to be given that as a hangover cure. Well, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the idea. <laughs> Day three. Um... Video City has something interesting to say about you. Man, you're right. I really need him in a collar and leash. What? Um... No. <laughs> anyway. I don't know, Draft. You said they could call you daddy, and now you're being put in a collar my and door. leash. Okay. Was for comedic effects, by the way. Okay. Lucas, not everything's <laughs> about you. So you catch up on any Destiny 2 streams? Then you say no. Oh. Yeah, I'll get to it one of these months. Are you? How far behind are you, Videosity? Anyway, I'm glad. Gobly Labs to fight invasive lionfish by releasing killer algae. UFO spotted by face National Guard fighters this morning. Always change your OTP. <laughs> Government advice. <laughs> Preventing data leaks. Baffles everybody. <laughs> uh oh, did you hear about the latest government leak? And uh... The War Thunder Discord server is trying to prove the developers were wrong. What? 
Um, someone in the military released uh, confidential blueprints of an aircraft to, like, I mean, in an argument with game developers of War Thunder. <laughs> of course they did. <laughs> Again. Apparently this happens a lot. There has been zero days since somebody has leaked military documents in a War Thunder forum. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna post that later. I'm gonna be honest. I Leave think I was. Oh, sorry. I was reading Video City Sync. They said, "Well, you made like 30 plus streams, right? I've only seen like seven. There have been more. I'm pretty sure there's more than like 30 plus. I mean, I've made a lot of Destiny 2 content. <laughs> like out You're of dead. all the videos on my channel, that might be one of the most." I remember I looked you up, and Destiny 2 pops up, as well as, like, I think it's a picture of Gustav from Beauty and the Beast mid-song of no one, like, does whatever like Gustav. No one. Yeah, I know which one you're talking about. For whatever reason, I just, I just can't think of the song. No one dances like Gustav, no one. <laughs> It's Guston. It's got an N in it. Oh, Guston. Yeah. Gaston, that's what it is. Gaston. Gaston. No one fucks like Gaston. No one cooks like Gaston. You thought you had a wife. No, it's mine. I'm Gaston. <laughs> okay. I'm an adult, I promise. It got replaced. Oh. Now you drag the bat. When, now when you look up Drac the Bat, it's Poker Night and Destiny 2 that pops up. Oh, hell yeah. On YouTube. Those are like two of my most famous series, so that makes sense. Plus yeah. that fiction, fishing action is just reverting to watch. Way cooler than in Sonic Adventure. <laughs> the fishing action is just riveting to watch. Way cooler. Hey, at least, what, you want me to scream like Aaron Hansen did? Yeah, you really amused yourself there. Yeah. Yeah. Check this before anybody arrives and before I read things. Oh, she's probably gonna join oh. today, Lua. She looks pretty, I like the flowers. Uh, going... Oh yeah, she's adorable, if I remember correctly. Anyone else? Listening to... Listening is an art. Myrtle says, listening is an art I often take for granted. Liked by Yo Aqua and five others. I like it too. It's nice when things are communicated properly. Just found out coffee, honey, and milk drink is not a meal replacement. <laughs> I'll just stop these young fellers for drunk driving, so that's a lesson for y'all to keep your spirits in control. <laughs> Get what it. What a post. <laughs> <laughs> what, Georgie's or Lucas's? Georgie's. Y'all to keep your spirits in control? <laughs> <laughs> the dad jokes. Yeah. Uh, Bailey said, "Quality work comes with the price. You can't ask for a thousand dollar quality and ask to pay a hundred and fifty dollars. Respect the people you've dedicated decided to work with." Yeah. Yeah. That's a hippie post too. Yeah. One I like second. that they're actually making posts that is them reflecting what they were talked to about. Oh. I have returned again! No, Aqua's listening is an art. You can tell she posted that from Starbucks. Post that from Starbucks. I don't run a Starbucks. 
This is coffee talk, god damn it. <laughs> By the way, did your phone battery suck? I've been using this power bank in the past month. Click the link for info. Thanks, Bailey. Party drinks, restocking, new schedule due, new regulations, cut off order time. Shop closed at 1.30, delivery for bill of it. Rachel! Oh wow, I that's don't love you. No, no! You're like the pop star or whatever. Just finished. Um. Coffee Talk is just a knockoff of the official Starbucks RPG on the Wii. I don't want to give the Starbucks baristas any of the information that I'm giving, that these people are giving me. Just finished today's dance practice. I'm all sweated out, but my coach said that I've really improved lately. Yay! What were you saying, Remy? Oh, in Lucas's post, the, uh, go... Yeah, that one. The link in it, the bit.ly link, leads to Lucas's Twitter. It's an actual URL. Wait, and it's just... send me that. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool as hell. <laughs> it's, um, it's a picture. It's a bunch of pictures of Lucas holding up pizza and, like, doing a selfie. Can I post it in chat? Like, I don't know if it'll let me. You should. You can just send it in DMs. Um, I'm doing it on the Steam Deck, so, like... We'll just do it here. Nope, that didn't work. It didn't set, go through? Nope. Alright. Might mm. have links turned off because of bots. Yeah, that would make sense. Alright. There's an angry atmosphere out there tonight. Feels like a night for old go. friendships. Ah! If you plug that into a browser, it'll just go to his Twitter. Bitly dot Lucas on. And new acquaintances. Hmm. Is anyone there? Oh, a cat. Hello, you gave me a start. You're Neko Mimi, right? You're gonna transform any second now. <coughs> or maybe not. <coughs> yeah, I'm sure about that. Oh, it's you, Lua. You wanna do her voice, or do I? Yeah, I sure. Her voice. Um. Let me try to think of a voice for her. Remember, I, I think she's meant to be voice. like a tiefling or something, if that helps. That does not help at all. Damn it. What would that be? What's her job? Is she like a rock star? I don't know what I... You know how long it's been since I've played the first game? Like three years, no. I think. Two or like oh. a couple years. Hey, Drac. You know what? That works. And, hey, new customer? Professional streamer. Yeah, that's me. Quote unquote professional. I definitely have my own studio and, and not recording this in my parents or in my current, fuck, what was I saying? In my bedroom right now. And I'm definitely not just sitting on a mattress on a phone call with Drac. Yeah, we're we're definitely doing this game grum style. We got our own couch, like a collection we of games office. and game. Yeah, we have our own office and everything. <laughs> We've got our own building. We bought a skyscraper. Yeah. Ever heard of the Empire State? <laughs> yeah, that's down the hall from us. Down the hall from us. <laughs> yeah, we built an extension in Empire State, don't we? <laughs> Just hanging off the edge in, our, in like a small <laughs> box, that's it. Hey, I'm on a mattress too, that's so cool maybe. <laughs> Thanks, Video City. 
<laughs> Hi, Miss Lua. I don't think this is the coffee drinking sort of cat. I think it's just a cat. No. It it would appear no, it would appear not. Do you have a new pet cat then? Yes. I mean, I'm not quite sure. This is the first time seeing this little one. It got closer. It's a magic cat. It can teleport. Are you sniffing me, kitty? Do you want cuddles? Guess not. All right. All right. No cuddles. I don't know why this voice is going more and more like serial killer-esque, but... Cats! Cats! Indeed! I wonder if it's lost, but it doesn't have a color, so it might be a stray. Yeah, you're going into, hmm, I wonder if it's lost. <laughs> it might be yeah. a stray. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I don't know how to do voices. It's cute, though. Would make a nice mascot. This isn't a cat cafe, but you know what? Anything to bring up customers, I guess. <laughs> I would think that's... Uh, I would think that's up to it, not up to us. Cats. Right. Yes. Thanks, Video City. Anyhow, it's been a little while. Oh, I thought it fell out of the chair. <laughs> <laughs> It decided to die. No. <laughs> oh, that's what I was doing. I was coming Joker. Why so serious? Why so serious? <laughs> it has. Last time we saw you was well over a week ago, wasn't it? What have you been up to? Honestly? Mostly work, as usual. I won't lie. It's pretty beat. I'm pretty beat. I I'm, I read it as it's too. I don't know why. <laughs> First word. Just, the apostrophe's in a weird place. Did you just... Did you just leave the office? Yes. But in my defense... I spent the last hour looking at wedding dresses on Tomodachi. Tomada chill. Tomada chill. Domo dot chill. Well, that sounds like fun, doesn't it? Right. It was the at. Uh, right. It was the apostrophe. Shut up, Video City. We all know you can't read. It's not unfun. Hmm. That's a moderately enthusiastic response. How are your wedding preparations going? Are you guys getting married? Am I invited? Will I be running the bar? I'm gonna be running the bar, aren't I? Anyway, how are you're the wedding the... preparations going? <laughs> you're the person getting married, Drek. They're I didn't going. Ask for this. I was invited to a wedding and wasn't even asked. Er. Hey, I don't do pretty day okays. They're going. Oh, okay. Um. I might need a drink before I answer that. We have some new selection of teas. Didn't look like you could use something warm. I don't know why I read warm like that. I feel weird now. Something warm and cozy? Yes. Milky and soothing with just a bit of warm spice. I'm going to hit my pillow soon, so something that will help me sleep. I might have idea. And I can see you have snazzy new ingredients. That will- We have blue bee and hibiscus now. I'm not sure if any of those are good for sleeping. I just think they look pretty when they're 
meld together with water. That sounds interesting. I'd like to try hibiscus then, with milk and warm spice, please. Okay, that actually sounds pretty easy. Uh, hibiscus. Hibiscus. She said hibiscus, milk, and warm, right? Yeah. Milk. That one gives more warm ginger. Ooh. Milk ginger hibiscus. I think that's it. I think so too. And get some good latte art going here. Actually, wait. <laughs> wait, wait! Do the horns. You gotta do the demon horns. <laughs> Let's just extend these out the horns. There we go. <laughs> Serve it. Angry, sleepy time to eat. <laughs> From introverts that don't want to sleep. We're in Aww, bolts, we poor kitty. Did the machine wake you up? Here goes the mascot. Maybe it'll come back later. I bet it will. Cats always have reasons for their actions. I really doubt that. Even if they're often rather mysterious ones. That's true. Anyway, here's your drink, Miss Lua. This is nice. Even it's a bit different from what I had in mind. I think it was supposed to be Man. something. Yeah, I'm a bitch. Thanks, Drac. Of course. I mean, she didn't specify which one she wanted, so it's technically right. So I technically still did right. Yeah. Right, so the wedding preparations. You and Mr. Bailey's are still getting married, of course. Of course? Reasons for their actions, even if mysterious, just like furries. Don't judge me. Or me. Oh yes, absolutely. After everything we've been through, I'm not about to back down now, it'd be a waste. Bailey is still very much my person. With the long ears and all. You know, I've thought about it, and I think my plan B if my, uh, if YouTube and stuff doesn't work out. I think I'm going, I, th I think I'd like to, like, own my own record shop. Or music shop in general. I think that would be fun. That would right be, that'd that'd be nice. Hurry, my world is shattered. And he never guessed. Who would have guessed that person on Twitch named Drac the Bat, who seems to really enjoy bats, and also has a character that looks like a bat, would be a furry. Video City don't look now, but most of the VTuber channels, they're furries. I think you read that, didn't you? Yes. Okay, cool. I'm guessing that they're one of the, uh, I forgot what it's called, but what Lucas is. No. A satyr. No, they're not a satyr. I think oh, okay. they're meant to be like. I think they are meant to be a tiefling. No, 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 Bailey. No, Bailey's an elf. She said. Oh. Bailey's she said like. The long ear, boy. Yeah, Bailey's hundred percent an elf. And I know that because there was a whole like. There was a whole like. It wasn't. It, I don't know if it's right to call it quest line, but there was a whole story about like how his family didn't like her because she was different. 
and how he felt weird about it because he does like her. And he said, "Fuck it, I don't need my family's anything. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be with her because I like her." And then, you know, things. You'll know when you're older. Uh, <laughs> don't know those pesky cold feet. Sounds like good news. No cold feet, and no cold anything. In fact... My stress is running so high. I feel like I have steam coming out of my horns. Oh, so there's no smoking in here? Uh... That doesn't sound like good news. Can you put out the cigarette? Yeah. <laughs> It's just such a big thing, you know. It'll oh, get not. ashes everywhere. It's just putting out the <laughs> cigarette. You have an ashtray right there. Just put it out. I feel like that's all we talk about. Because you're always smoking in my damn shop. Well, you're <laughs> always bringing up cancer in my damn <laughs> cigarette time. <laughs> she's not cold, she's smoking. <laughs> Good one, Video City. That's great. But we're not making much progress. Well, yeah. You haven't put the cigarette out yet. You never have since you started coming here. <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny to me. <laughs> we're not further along than we were two weeks ago. Well, I mean, you could always try to quit smoking. That would fix this whole conversation. It's bad for you anyway. <laughs> now I'm just sneakily put nicotine patches on my partner. Get them addicted so we can have together cigarette time. This is gonna be a great YouTube short. I argue with a fake character for hours about her smoking in my goddamn <laughs> coffee shop. <laughs> you have different expectations of the day? Like, you know, maybe not smoking in my coffee shop? I don't know. I do know. Stop smoking in my coffee shop. <laughs> Alright, I might quit. I might be running this joke dry. I'm not sure I even know what my expectations are anymore. It's what? like you're trying to keep me from smoking in here. Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> it's almost as if I don't want you smoking in here anyway. Why would I try to stop you? Unless I don't want you smoking in my goddamn coffee shop. It's almost like you took my lighter away. Wait, you do have a lighter item. I do. Are you going to give it to her? No, it's... It's his, like... Uh, it's like his family heirloom or something. Oh, I thought these items were like you're supposed to give it to people to... You're supposed to give them to specific people. See, here's uh, Georgie's lighter. Okay. I look at all these weddings on Tomodo Chill. Don't change the subject. Yeah, none of your jokes run dry. Yeah, none of them. At all, ever. And they all do the special over the top stuff, yeah, like well, interventions. Yeah, I bet none of them smoke in my coffee shop. I don't have any original ideas like that. Well, being real, a wedding is just supposed to be something you both enjoy. Just do something that makes you guys happy. It doesn't have to be this weird, spectacular, over-the-top bullshit. I totally forgot we weren't talking about cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> you get merch, get a t-shirt. It's, uh, it's like there's no smoking. It's like there's no smoking in my goddamn coffee shop. <laughs> Nobody's gonna understand that reference at all. And that's what makes it perfect. Because I'll see people wearing it and it'll make me laugh. And they won't get it. <laughs> I think I was supposed to read that and I forgot. He does, but that's another issue. Fucking dumping my cigarettes out. <laughs> my parents are willing to pay for part of the wedding as long as there's nicotine patches at the bar. 
and I earn a good living, so I can cover most of it. Bay wants to contribute his share, but he can't really afford it. Yeah, his parents are like filthy stinking rich, but he's cut off because he's marrying her. Ah. Yeah, his parents are dicks. Not the good kind either. Don't let that linger. And as you know, his parents aren't in the picture anymore. Yeah, they're kind of assholes. I don't think I ever met them, but they're kind of assholes. You understand. Why can I not get this right? Oh, I'm turning it up, I think. That's why. Yeah, I do. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room. A rubber room. A rubber room filled with rats. Rats drive me crazy. Crazy? I was crazy once. They put me in a room. A rubber room. A rubber room with rats. Rats drive me crazy. Look up the Reading Registry. It's all different cigarette brands. <laughs> it's just each one is like sponsored by Marlboro. <laughs> Marlboro, are you bride or groom? Which section are you? Camel, uh uh uh. We talked about this year, the ring bearer, not the best man. If you wanted to be the best man, you should have sucked up a little bit more. No, it's dicks. I get it. It's just not funny. Ow, my, my pride. My hubris. Well, you didn't have to hurt my hubris. Do you still feel guilty about that? No, I don't think so. Good, because you shouldn't. That's his parents' yeah. fault, not mine. Is that a QR code? Where? Do you see my mouse at all? Yeah, I can, but that's not. That's just a sign saying, like, something. But it's yeah. not a QR code. Hang on. Are you going to try scanning it? Yep, nothing's coming up. Okay. I like how Remy is creating a whole RPG in his head, and I'm trying to... Nope, there's two of them. I don't think there would be two of them if it was a QR code. Onward! Okay. Oh, Video City, you should see some of my D&D ideas. If I've learned anything, it's that. You need to let the people you love make their own choices. But I am concerned. Well, I mean, you care about them. It's okay to be concerned. Both about A, dropping all his savings on this stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I would be concerned too. Yeah. And about him trying to guess what I want. I feel like that's more of a communication issue though. And like, that's kind of your fault too though. You're asking if the sign is a QR code? Yeah, it kind of looked like it in a way, maybe. I mean, not really, but. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Rather than expressing his own wishes. Oh, I get it now. Like, not buying you a gift, but trying to do things for you. Because... Just to do things for you. Rather than doing what he wants. I understand well, it, I, I just don't know how to throw it into words. Him spending a bunch of money... Him trying to pay for the wedding even though he can't afford it. And give her this big dream thing. At least I think that's what it's talking about, and then, he's, like, he's, he's trying breaking to get himself she... in order to do something she wants, and she doesn't like that because it's breaking him. There we go. I figured it out. I know how to do it. Yeah. I know how words work. Are you kidding me? Good job. I, I made a perfect grade in freshman English. That's not a lie. You get an airplane landing for that. Hell yeah. Free airplanes. Rather than expressing, okay, you already read that. Sounds Here, you like you're putting have eyes too. I can have what? Oh, oh. 
his thighs. <laughs> Sounds like you're putting a lot of pressure on yourself. Trying to make sure everyone's happy. Even her phone has horns. That's actually adorable. Maybe. Why can't my phone have horns? Why can't you be connected? Oh. You are cool. I really like this phone. But I guess that's unavoidable, right? I don't know. Just make your phone hornier. Oh, hi. Girl, it's you. Oh, hello. Neil? So... Those, so, all right, should I say this? Because it would be, actually, no, Neil himself isn't spoilers. So there was this weird character that you met at some point in the game. And that character would, and that character was like an alien who could like shapeshift. And the first thing he saw when he got to Earth was the image of an astronaut. So he assumed that's what everybody here looked like, and he transformed into an astronaut. Mm. You meet him again later, and he's got, like, a normal... A normal-looking skin suit on. Or a normal... He looked normal. <laughs> Instead of, like, a spaceman, so... I don't I think you're saying a normal... normal. You said normal looking skin suit. I don't think anything with the word skin suit in it looks normal. <laughs> I mean, the ones I wear look normal. Hi. Hi. See? Videosity, mate. See, videosity. Me about weeks ago. Videosity agrees with me. The one who used to come to the cafe. It be them, but I'm not sure now. I didn't seem to react to my greeting. Besides, last time we saw Neil, he had changed his name to Silver. Actually, a cool name. Yeah. And he looked kind of normal. His skin suit worked perfectly. I see. This is all, all very mysterious. Also, is that scales poking out? Did you hear them come in? Didn't. But then I really do. They're stealthy. I'll I'll do her. Oh, I was gonna give her a valley girl voice. No, I got her. <laughs> Bartender, what does a girl have to do to get a drink around here? Or me and step one. Uh, I beg your pardon. This isn't quite that kind of a place. You can't change your name to Silver. It's no use. Ah, memories. Bad memories. I wanted. I couldn't find that game, by the way. I couldn't find Sonic 06 anywhere, so I can't play that game on stream now. God damn it. Isn't it? Oh, wait, no. Isn't it? Our research indicates that this is the way one should order a drink. In a place of public consumption. It sounds like your research was based on orc westerns. I feel like that was a little racist. No, like westerns. Like, you know, westerns? Yeah. It's Cowboy just sort westerns? of orc westerns. Well, orcs might have made westerns. I think that was the gist. It wasn't supposed to be racist. <laughs> okay. I thought, <laughs> thought it was like, no, you think of orc culture. That... No, not our what? culture, just westerns. Okay. Is there anything wrong with orc westerns? We rather enjoy them. No, I guess not. Maybe Project 06 is worth a shot. I think it's. I think the only thing they have is a demo, and I beat it in like 20 minutes. Wouldn't be a very fun stream. 
They're just very different from reality. In what ways? That, um... It would take a very long time to answer that. Honestly, yeah. Not every stereotype is racist, I... lol. I mean, not technically, I guess. I guess. The... Yeah. I guess the better question is, how are they similar? How are they similar? You did say it was the better question. That's fair enough. I suppose the honest answer is... It'd be fun to stream, because you're a fun streamer. Maybe. Thanks, Video City. Maybe. The way people feel emotions is similar. How they're ambitious and have dreams. How they want things and sometimes get jealous of others. But also how they help each other out. It doesn't mean you're allowed to start a shootout in the street to save somebody, okay? That's not okay. We have police for that. And how they fall in love. You're not allowed to start a shootout just to get someone to like you, okay? We have police for that. <laughs> no problem, cornbread. <laughs> It sounds like Earthlings have very busy feelings. One way of putting it. I guess we do. Are your people very different in that respect? We are. Although, we <coughs> want things too. But it appears that Earthlings have at least 94.328% more emotions than we do. How do you how do you distinguish between them? Heh, <laughs> to be honest, sometimes we don't. Yeah, feelings are confusing. Even though they come from inside of you, they tend to be weird and off and not really work right sometimes. Don't be judging people with shootout kinks. <laughs> Reading others isn't easy, nor is understanding ourselves, for that matter. That adds some... spice to life, I guess. It sounds to us like it would be helpful to have those emotions played. Especially in movies. Perhaps you could write them at the top of the screen? I'm uh, from the 1920s would certainly agree with you. You're supposed to feel fear! Get scared! Rawr! That help? But, pardon me. You're not Neil, are you? Or Silver? Indeed, we are not. Our name is Amanda. So, there are several of you here on Earth? Sorry, somebody posted something. I gotta check. Did I get a friend? I got a friend! Amanda. Yep. <laughs> That's that her! Photo, that photo makes it look like a space kitty helmet. Oh, I can Looks see like it. Looks like it has an ear. Yeah. There are a great many of us everywhere. Our average density is 3450.5.45 per galaxy. But this is not the to topic of our present conversation. Oh, you wanted a drink, didn't you? 
We do wish to absorb some liquid matter, yes. Similarly to what the purple earthling has been doing. The purple earthling? Jeez, Pink, don't be racist. <laughs> 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 That is certainly a description. I mean, I don't want to call it racist because you know I don't. They're being descriptive. They're not trying to use it in a mean way. So. Yeah. Is it wrong? Would it be more accurate to describe you as the four appendages or something? They are just everybody. Do you mean my horns and my ears? Oh, oh no. Uh, Miss Amanda, we usually avoid addressing customers by the number of their appendages. Oh, we apologize, but we cannot address the, per the, the customer by name as we do not know it. Oh, I haven't introduced myself. That's my bad. I'm Lua. 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 Lua Weed! Lua. Yes. It is very ple it is a ve it has a very pleasing sound. Oh. Well, thank you. We wish to absorb some liquid matter as Lua has been doing. Of course. And do you have an idea of what kind of, uh, liquid matter that might be? Something bright colored and memorable. I can do that. We weren't our first drink on Earth to be an experience we shall never forget. No pressure, Shirak. That's quite alright. We were born to rise to this kind of challenge. That's the spirit. Any other ideas, Miss Amanda? We want the taste to be very spicy. I keep forgetting that that I'm this character for some reason. We know that You're some good. paces serve weak drinks. Do bipeds with female denominations. Our research has determined that behavior to be undesirable and 99.9999999 of occurrences. Fortunately, this isn't that kind of place either. Lua has such a nice sound to it. I see. Indeed, so you'd like a vivid and spicy. What if it was, let's say, blue and gingery? We do not know what gingery means, but blue and gingery sounds good to us. Okay, that is easy. There we go. Warm and bitter as shit. This should knock your socks off and look pretty while doing it. Mm-hmm. Do you mind if I blue piece stuff? Blue lightning. Oh wow. Go ahead. Oh, you can't make art. Oh, I was just gonna ask if I could say uh, a number while you were making it, but you already finished. I'm very good at my job. <laughs> you are. But yeah, this is. I want to try. It looks good. I want to try blue blue PT at some point. Blue lightning yeah. coming right up. Too bad. The best remedy for an upset tummy or a bored mind, uh, bored mind, and a pretty color to boot. Hey. Oh wait, there were other things. They didn't write anything. <laughs> Or maybe they did. Nope.
This is vivid indeed. Now let's try it. Oh yeah, that's how they drink, by the way. Hmm. This is interesting. We heard that we might struggle to experience taste. But we can certainly feel the kick of this. Your reputation was well deserved, Drac. And what kind of reputation is that? Sounds like word is getting around. So if you ask if she's horny, would she flip out? Yeah, who? No, she's talking about Lua. <laughs> Probably. Oh. <laughs> are Do you, you mean horn the I mean, horny are you, customer? I <laughs> <laughs> Do you mean the horny customer over there? You know, the one with two horns. With more appendages than normal. Amanda, we don't know how many appendages people have. Amanda, it's rude to talk about people's appendages, especially the ones they're hiding. Yeah, you never know what type of condition they're in or what medicines they're taking. Okay, so back to Lua. <laughs> Soon this place will become a hipster den. God forbid. I should probably start looking for an alternative form. Oh, I like your company. I hope not. I would miss you a lot, Miss Lua. Besides, isn't that what a hipster does? Go to a place only before they become cool? Fuck you, I'm smoking now. Touche. Oh, not in my coffee shop! Damn you, Lua! I guess you'll be stuck with me a while longer. God damn Hopefully it. Hopefully you can get the cigarette stains out of things. I'm gonna burn your house down with the cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way. I would stop smoking in my goddamn coffee shop. <laughs> you can't cuss out the purple woman. Watch me. <laughs> Now, Miss Amanda. Now, Miss Amanda, what was it? Of, what was that about my reputation? We heard about you from our sibling, formerly known as Neil. I see. Sibling, huh? This isn't a future hipster den. This is an alien den. I mean, I guess there's worse dens to be in. You should consider rebranding as Cafe Close Encounters. Smoking available. No smoking! That makes it sound like a rather different types of place. Yeah! <laughs> Cafe Close Encounters. The staff here is real friendly. Smoker and non. All smokers have to sit in the smoker corner. <laughs> it's outside in the rain. On the other Slipping side of the street. I just realized that earlier Video City talked about <laughs> furries judging smokers. <laughs> Please define your question. You mean here on this planet? That too, but also here in this cafe. No orgy video city. No smoker orgy video, uh, video city. That's not okay. Unless it's weed. And there's coffee. And coffee. We are on this planet on a research and rescue mission. Is that like a search and rescue? Perhaps it is a mission to gather numbers for research as well as to rescue our sibling. We are in this cafe to wait for them. We made an appointment, as is the custom here. They should arrive in two minutes, three seconds, and 12 milliseconds. Please pardon the roughness of our estimate. That's more than good enough. You are very kind. 
Drac has mentioned your sibling a few times. I think Silver, right? Indeed, we are part of the same hive mind. A hive mind? That sounds pretty amazing. But doesn't that make appointments less useful? That would have been true some time ago. But Neil, now known as Silver, is becoming more human by the day. Their connection to the hive mind grows... tenuous. Oh. I must feel a little lonely. To lose your connection to your family when you've been so close. Hmm, perhaps. What does it mean to be lonely? It's, uh... It's like depression, except you have nobody there. When you think about other people and they're not here... Weed orgy? Like, Ouija? <laughs> now uh, all we need is some board. Ah, <laughs> with those puns. And that makes you sad. It makes you feel like you have a weight on your chest. Like things that usually feel good to you lose a lot of their appeal. Thank you for your explanation. We think we see. We do not know. Perhaps it is a little lonely. We cannot answer. I cannot answer this with more than a 61% certainty. Silver! I think. Is this Silver? Who are you? Uh, Too many puns. Shop, everyone. You need punished. No, I'm not voicing Silver. <laughs> I'm not voicing Silver. Okay, I'll voice him then. <laughs> I am <Amanda. laughs> Speaking of the space person, here comes my former regular. Ah, I apologize. I haven't been coming by often enough lately. Hi. I'm Lua. Nice to meet you, Lua. I'm Silver. I've heard a lot about you. I got a new friend! Edgelord! Fantastic! Have you? You probably pictured me in a bigger suit. Bonk, I don't guess punish so, Remy. yeah. They punish you. <laughs> what the hell, Remy? <laughs> Video City said you need to be finished. <laughs> and you said to call your daddy. Oh a bit God. like your sibling here. I understand, but I've been undergoing many changes. Aha! This form makes me feel truer to I, who I am now. That's not what I wanted to click on. I also changed my name for the same reason. Have you been waiting long, Amanda? Not un- not unduly. This is a bit of a It's a bit. Amanda? Wait, no. Amanda. Yes? You should know that. I have been missing you a lot. What is miss? Is it like being lonely? Yes, it is. But did you learn what loneliness is? We have been told that it is the name of the feeling we have when we think about you. That's... I... I just... Bring it in. They're gonna hug! Bring what? Oh. What are you saying, Remy, that Automata is telling me you're being rude? 
Oh well, I'm sure it's fine. And a collabor and a collaborator Collaborate. as well as a degenerate. Video City called me an instigator. Yeah, I see. <laughs> Is degenerate banned by Automod? I think that's the word that got hit, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, my entire present got banned hammered. My entire presence. My entire presence is not welcome in my own stream. Here is one long have hug. Some pies. <laughs> so cute. And here you do know. Ahem. Right. As we were saying, we appreciate you being only three milliseconds late. It's good to see you haven't changed. You have, and yet, you haven't. Now that you are close, you feel part of the hive again. Now that you are close, you feel part of the hive again. And your presence is similar to what it always was. Makes me really happy to hear that. You should order a drink, as is customary. Then we can proceed with our discussion of the mission. The mission? Yes, we are going to destroy this planet and raise it of all its resources. Ah, <laughs> oh, well, the most important resource you could get is cigarettes. Here, try one. Dear Lord. <laughs> oh, didn't Drek tell you that? Not really. Well, the reason I came here in the first place was to find love. You mean to reproduce with the local species? Right. I actually totally forgot about that part of his the reason why he was here. That's another way to put it. I think I remember you putting it in those terms yourself, so... I did, yes, but that was a long time ago. I'm gonna tell you everything. But first, Amanda is right. I'd like to order a drink. I can taste them properly now, so I enjoy them a lot more. Happy to hear that. What would you like? I'd like something new. Eek. I want to explore all these new sensations. Don't say words like that to me again. That's weird. Nothing too strong, please. Please be gentle. I don't have the same tolerance as Damn, also, no wonder. I'm in the mood you told something you a bit you, sweet and floral. So hibiscus. Maybe with a bit no, of refreshness to it. Nothing new, but not too strong. A bit sweet, floral, and refreshing. Maybe blue? Oh, I do love blue. Something sweet, floral, refreshing, and blue then. Are you gonna do the blue pea and the hibiscus? I'm gonna do blue. I can only do one main ingredient at a time. So blue, sweet, and what else? Hibiscus. I know they want. Hibiscus, I can't get I hibiscus. Think. No, they want something blue, so it's got to be blue pea. Yeah. Sweet, Sweet floral and floral. floral. I think the blue pea and is the one that's going to give it the floral taste, because it is technically a flower. And refreshing, so I think it has to up the cool level. A mint. Or milk. Yeah, I think that no, would be mint. it. Do mint. Worst comes to worst, I'll just redo it. Long yeah. Gallmord really goes with the chill music. <laughs> what, did the, the Discord freak out? Or our microphones, because we're definitely in the same room. Flower bed, yeah, that's I'm perfect. So sorry, I'll reconnect. Oh, oh, I love the little bee. And it's like yeah, a it's adorable. Set. This looks great, I love this. Yeah, I'll be right back. Okay. Yep, he's got nothing either. 
Fantastic. Do what? Yeah, we can hear you. Okay. Then let me check my group pad. Flowered bed. An entire garden in a teacup from the leaves to the pollen. Can you hear the bees? I feel like Lucas would like that one. Reconnect. Kingdom Hearts. Ram me. One bright flower bed for the silver person. I'm not sure what Lucas likes. He seems like he would like energy drinks more than anything. Just his personality. Yeah. This definitely looks unique. I can't wait to try it. Oh, yeah. Delicious. Drinking through my mouth makes such a difference. To be honest, I never expected to like it this way. Now, I never get enough of it. Remy. Drinking for the glove does look uncomfortable. It's a very different experience. <laughs> Not entirely unpleasant. No, it's also in its own way. But it doesn't convey taste in the mouth. It's, more, it's much more about sensation. It's definitely and intense but I'm happy I get to drink Drax creation hey they were intense as for the mission yes the mission it has run into some difficulties difficulties of what nature well <laughs> the truth is I still have finding myself a date what is a date? The step you need to take before I'm um, coupling up. You meet someone, you talk, take them to your favorite orgy spot, and then they leave screaming. At least that's been my experience. That's the best part about Drag Scream. We always have new experiences and sensation. <laughs> At least I'm unique. Except I'm not. Uh, maybe I am. I probably am. get to know the person. Not having high connection sounds exhausting. It can be a challenge, to be honest. But in another way, wonderful. Not the hive connection when you meet someone. Always a surprise. They react in ways I didn't expect. Ways I wouldn't. Every like pepper spraying Drac on a date. I don't get pepper spray. Dates. It was only once. <laughs> I mean, you have an orgy spot, so. <laughs> the coffee shop is never closed. Just the door sometimes is. <laughs> I clean it, I promise. About earthly species? That too, certainly. But most about my stuff. That's definitely what being someone is about. Every time you're honest with a person you love, you get out of your comfort zone and become a better person yourself. That sounds complicated. You need to make further compute. Computations to understand. It's different from what we used to, but it's also great. I mean, I have to go it pee. sounds to me like you've got it figured out. Oh. You have to pee? Absolutely. Oh, shall return. Entertain Video City okay. while I'm gone. So, Video City, tell me about your uh, dirty corner in the coffee shop. In college. What would people do in there? <laughs> I was told to entertain you. You brought up orgies. <laughs> Let's talk about them.
I mean, I could certainly entertain you. I just don't think it's stream appropriate. <laughs> but uh, so what would you guys do in that coffee shop? Oh, am I feeling better at all? Um, I'm still feeling a little down. Like, I feel a little congested, I guess, and my throat's a little sore still, but for the most part, I think I'm okay. I, uh, I'm kind of always sick, though. It's just, like, getting an actual, like, virus or cold or anything makes my sickness a lot worse. So, I just, I don't typically feel great, and like, I'll get fevers, and like, I can end up collapsing if I push myself too far, so getting an actual, like, sickness outside of that really pushes me to my limit a lot more than it would most people. So it also takes me a lot longer to recover, which is why just the common cold has had me down for like two weeks. Thank you, I, I try to be sweet, but I don't know, just something you learn to live with, I guess. Like, I do the most I can and I don't, I worry about myself a lot less than I should, I guess. <laughs> but I have fun when I talk to people. Oh no. Three colds in a row? I can't imagine. I would... I, <laughs> I don't think I would survive. Like, that sounds horrible. I've only ever gotten the flu once in my life. And I, I swear I thought I was gonna die. Like, it was the worst thing. Also, yeah, why are the spots people fool around in in, like, shops and stuff the absolute comfiest? Well, I mean... I guess people would naturally fool around in the comfiest spots, so... I guess it makes sense. Maybe because they're worn. <laughs> yeah. I know, I know in the city I was in, there was one spot where, like, there was, like, this bar that would play some music. And it, it was never a crowded bar, but it was known for being that spot where people would go and do explicit things in the corner of the dance floor to the point that I had never been there, but people would go there and be like, yeah, you can't stand in corners of the dance floor because the carpet squishes. And it's like, ugh. Like, come on, there's a limit, you know? Like, Yeah. I... I've never intentionally gone to clubs, but I've ended up in clubs like three or four times. While I was sober. Weirdly enough, it's just kind of where the night took me. Limits are for quitters. <laughs> yeah! Cubs with batons and tasers. <laughs> 
Really? Oh, I've been, uh, I've been to a bar, but I didn't drink there. It was for a different reason. Okay. Well, clubs with like dancing and stuff are pretty nice when you go. Like oh. if everyone's dancing. Apparently, I got if a it's... follower yesterday, even though I didn't see him. Huh. It might have been honey. Serotonin. Serotonin. Yep. Yeah, serotonin bits. Okay. Thank you, Ani, for following me. I don't know if they can hear, or if he can hear. It's okay. Go back to sleep, Drax. So thank you for following them on Twitch. Oh, did I wake? Ani did says I, you're welcome. Did I wake him up? I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I said their name, so they woke up. Yeah, you're in headphones. You're good. Okay, good. Okay. Continuing. But yeah, I've never been in a club. Oh, by the way, Drac, you need to change the title. Why? Of your stream. Title? Um, right now it's just uh let's talk and drink coffee, but you need to change it to orgy and chill while I'm in the bathroom. I don't I don't I don't think that's right. <laughs> I mean, you said entertain video city. <laughs> Said entertain video city. I didn't say take over my stream. <laughs> You're welcome, sweetheart. <laughs> Don't use my own lingo against me. That's not allowed. That's illegal. Oh, bless your heart. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Those are side events. <laughs> Man, Drek is so selfish. It's my words. I only use them. <laughs> Thank you, you're very kind. And if I may say so myself, I think I have made some progress. If I did get a date, I think it would go better than before. Oh, hi, Drowie. Welcome. Ah. See, I talk about that topic and get another viewer. It's my words. I wear the daddy pants. <laughs> No, I wear the daddy pants. <laughs> God, I hate that. Though. Anyway, what's the problem then? Yeah, that is really good timing. <laughs> well, the thing is, Seattle is a very big city. Our state. Everyone is busy right around. And people aren't very trusting romantic movies. You can't just ask someone on the street to go on a date with you. Sounds like you tried. You guys ever think about hedgehogs? No, no, no hedgehogs. Furries and orgy are magic topic for your stream. We're not going to talk about Tycho's weird obsessions. When we're not even playing that game. I refuse. <laughs> Sounds like tough pride. <laughs> yes, I tried several times. I even stood on a plaza for a few hours with a deep me card around my neck. <laughs> no. <laughs> what is this, a friend episode? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> Hell oh this. my god. This is Barney Stinson. Silver's Barney Stinson. <laughs> <laughs> that is, um... Not an optimal strategy, yes. I've realized that since. I don't know. Do a lot of judging for non-judgmental people. You do? I don't think I'm very judgmental. I just think I'm funny. Yeah! People mostly seemed a little scared. Fair enough. <laughs> I hear most people meet their partners at work. You've gotten really, really saucy with that voice. Is that something you could try? Drac, what does saucy mean? Uh, I, I'm out of, I'm it. out of people lingo. Okay. Yeah, you'll figure it out. You'll, you'll figure it out. Just, like, I don't really know how to describe it. 
Honestly, that's why I don't date. Should be able to just go up and ask for dates. Remy's role playing as a smoker. Remy's role no, Remy's role playing is something else entirely. Remy's role playing oh, is like Remy's role playing is someone looking for clients. I'll just say that. I haven't smoked in a long time. <laughs> I've been smoking for 83 years. Oh, most can't people can't think can't I'm a, most people think I'm an old man. But I'm not. I'm a lady. Asi is like seductive? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Oh, well. I don't know, the voice of the just went where it went. Talking like this. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can <laughs> change fine. it. It doesn't bother me. Don't try. change it, it's fine. I just okay. noticed, are you a vampire furry VTuber? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that's exactly what that character is. <laughs> that's exactly what my character is. <laughs> that's I'm pretty sure you're the first person to actually understand. <laughs> Wait, you are? Yeah. I mean, the whole idea is that the whole like idea is that my character was originally just a bat that got bitten by a vampire, and here they are. They now have a human That's form so because cool. vampire. Yeah. I, know I can't up believe I. Okay. I was like, I swear I've asked you about your character's backstory, and you've never told me that. I never tell you that? No, I did. No. I think I had asked you before Anno came up with it then. Because at the yeah, time you were be. like, it's just a bat. I'm yeah, like that's probably what it was. <laughs> that's some cool lore, bro. I know, right? Totally in death. Has a lot of character development in it. Well, the thing is, Wait I always hear about the burning orphanage. <laughs> we don't talk about that. Anyway, the thing is, is that with my character, the whole, uh, the, it, like, it's supposed to be a representation of me, kind of. So giving it lore always felt weird because it's like. It's me, so <laughs> I don't really want to put my own, like, past out there, at least not like that. And yeah, don't feel like coming up with a story would be a good idea. But Anno said that, and I'm like, actually, that sounds fun. Let's do that. Yeah. Um... Just side thing real quick, Amanda and Silver, Amanda said there's about like 3,900 of their species per galaxy. Yeah. In the Milky Way, there's 3,916 solar systems in the Milky Way galaxy alone, which means there's a little bit more than one of Amanda's and Silver's species per solar system. I think it was like 3,400 or something? I don't know. Yeah. So it's if a little a... bit more. Uh, sorry, I was reading. Oh, no. You're good. Go. If you're a vampire furry, I'm happy. I love vampires and furries. Awesome. Thank you. I don't really know how to respond from there because I'm bad at social interactions. But you know what? Thank you for the... Thank you. Like I said, it was my friend who came up with it. I just rolled with it. Remy, Remy coming in with the nerd stuff. Thank you, Drowy, for the follow. I like that follow icon. Oh, what's the follow icon? It's like a, a drop down that has like, oh, like, purple yeah. and stuff. It's real pretty. Yeah. Maybe later on. I don't know. Wait, you were going to say something, Remy. What were you going to say? Oh, I was just saying, like, because initially when Amanda had said that about their species, I was like, oh, about one per plant. And then I realized, no, that wasn't saying per solar system. Like, I thought she said per solar system, about 4,000 per solar system, not per galaxy. And now yeah. it's like, wow, like... There's not even one per planet per galaxy. No wonder they're hard to find. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, like, I'm pretty sure they're kind of like the only 
like the hive mind is kind of just it for that species and they send out and for reproduction they just sort of send parts of itself out to reproduce yeah. which is what that happened with silver now nah, you're great interacting socially sense. thank you velocity i can't remember if i said that or not yet wait so does that mean silver is gonna impregnate someone and they're gonna give birth to like a face hugger I don't know how alien reproduction works, okay? Even in video like, games. Well, I just mean that'd be devastating to whoever Silver actually hooks up with, you know. I don't instead think of it's... having a kid. It'd be uh, like, okay, I'm taking the child. Bye! Back to the high mind. I don't think that's how it works, but I'm not sure. <laughs> but at the moment, I'm afraid. My work doesn't attract the right sort. I didn't know you'd found a job, Silver. Ah, uh, yes, I did. A few months ago. We decided to open a cafe. Wait a minute. Hang on a minute. You pastor! Wait a minute. That's the cafe across the street. Right. Really? <laughs> Does that mean drag has competition? Not at all. I would never want that. It rather feels like a small way to start a family tradition. Oh, that's actually kind of sweet. Interesting. Yeah, interesting. Also, I'm just going to go ahead and say this because I'm noticing things that you guys probably aren't. But there might be spoilers ahead, so be prepared. For the first game, that is. After I tried all that, I was running out of ideas. Gret calls the Mafia. <laughs> so I decided to... to reinstall lone... Re no, reinstall, okay. So I decided to reinstall Lonely Hearts, like I did when I had just arrived here. Dating does not sound like a reasonable solution. You read it wrong, it does. Oh, it does. Online dating does sound like a reasonable solution. Hat kid can deal with mafia. Who's hat kid? What? That's what Vila Video City said. Hat kid can deal with mafia. I thought so too. But the amount of dates I've gotten since I downloaded it is. Based on surrounding parameters, we will guess. Absolutely zero. <laughs> Aww. Amanda, you ain't got to dunk on him that hard. Dropping your ball, so Remy, you're a professional voice actor. Says Video City. Oh, de yes, of course. How, how could I drop it? I clearly get paid $200 an hour for this. Oh, yeah. They're definitely getting paid. Definitely. I'm definitely yeah. paying Remy money. He is definitely yeah. getting paid. I promise. I'm definitely this is getting not paid in any Sure. There, this is <laughs> definitely not ex this is definitely not any a, a, not extortion at all. This isn't like Yeah. Yeah, they're getting properly compensated. I don't sound saucy because I'm in daddy's basement being forced to do this. Plus orgy benefits. Thank you, Video City. <laughs> <laughs> the best YouTube clip ever. That is accurate. Oh no. Do you know why? If I'm being honest, I think I have an idea, but it might sound strange to me. The online dating process feels a little... No, it feels a lot... Alien. Fair enough. Please expand your explanation. Do you mean it lacks earthly species? I don't sound saucy because I'm in daddy's basement. That's right, Video City. I don't keep them locked up down there. You can't prove that. What made outfits? There's none. I promise. 
I didn't get butler training. <laughs> oh no. It has oh wait. Oh no. It has nothing to do it has fuck. Fuck up my reading now. I don't know how you did it, but you did. <laughs> oh, that maid outfits, that's where the thigh highs come from. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I never said anything in that video. Damn it. <laughs> oh no, it has... It has earthlings in all shapes and forms. But it feels impossible to connect with it. It was much more successful. I was much more successful at it when I first tried months ago. Well, that's because you grew a personality since then, love. Wait, who said Black Ba? Black Butler, that is my favorite anime, says Rowie. How about me? That would be me. Now, it's a little like peanut butter thigh highs, I remember. No, they weren't peanut butter. They weren't peanut butter thigh highs. Not gonna dig too far into that statement. How oh, my connection oh, to the hive mind has been recently. I'm part of it, to some extent. I feel like if I can just reach out to it, find understanding, then I do reach out, and I only find silence. Are you two peoples? Are the, are you two peoples there? Why I hear two voices? Yes, there are two of us. Yes. It's a little Sebastian to Daddy's Grell. Drac is uh, uh, the other voice that's talking, and owns the stream, and you can tell when they're talking because their little thing will pop up. Do you have the Discord connection going right now to where it'll show me when I talk? I'm not even going to lie to you. I have no idea how I hooked that up to, the, to my uh, Destiny one specifically, and I don't know how to do it again. Shit. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> uh, oops, that's not good. That's not good. I'm Remy, and I'm a friend of Drax, and the other voice that you hear when the little PNG tuber is not moving. Yes. Sebastian and Grail is my favorite character. Sometimes I roleplay Grail the most. I have learned that people who find Grail the most interesting character, especially to the point of cosplaying them, have some interesting interests well i thought we and were not in a bad stream. way like good no we were in my stream this is this is my house get your crumbs off the goddamn carpet and stop smoking in my goddamn copy shop wait you thought remy was running drac the bat stream instead of drac the bat yeah but you said it in a bad way lol no, it's fine. There's no bad blood here. Also, no, Video City and Drowie, I just met people that love Grell, are very interesting to talk to because they have new, like, interests that I haven't exactly, like, delved into a lot. So it's cool to learn all sorts of new things from people that like Grell the most, and especially people that cosplay Grell. How do I put it better? People that cosplay Grell typically, instead of having special, like, different interests, have hyper fixations that are, like, different from societal norms and really, really cool. Like, the last person I know that cut, that you, got to the point of cosplaying Grell, like, are you collected people, bones. Are you calling people who like Grell autistic? What? No, no divergent. <laughs> yeah, everyone has hyperfixations. Wait, am I? Everyone has hyperfixations, right? I don't. That's a thing. No, <laughs> I don't think so. 
maybe I'm just autistic and I'm not understanding things. For I some would reason, I'm attracted to Grill always... and I don't know why. Do you mean attracted? Remy, how could you? This is video. <gasps> I. <laughs> There's no offense. I'm just so socially awkward that every all of my friends always come up to me and be like after knowing me for two years being like wait i thought you had autism what do you mean you don't and i'm like why do you think that and they're like i don't know you just seemed very autistic i don't know maybe i have autistic i don't know you probably have autism i probably have autism i probably have autism I feel like everyone in the world is autistic to a degree. It's just I don't think that's not a, a diagnosable that. degree. Yeah, that's not a good way to word that. I'm bad at words, and please don't quote me on things. What is artism? No, autism. It's a mental disorder. Disorder. Yes. It's hard to describe, but it's a thing, and it causes your brain to work differently. Yes. Everyone's socially awkward. Yeah, I think that's that's okay to say. Everybody's got a little bit of social anxiety. I think that's a little bit e easier to say than everybody has autism, because I don't think that's correct. Yeah. Everyone's neurodivergent. Not everyone has autism. That's what I'm trying to say. I... Bad uh, words. Please I'm, don't quote me yeah. things. <laughs> Remy 916.23. <laughs> No, but actually, please keep that as the only quote that you ever quote for people that quote me. I have idea. I'm gonna steal this. Oscillate. Untaken. I also have a mental disorder, so I understand you, Remy. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. I mean, all the love. Here, um, I did a fucky wucky, so have some thighs in chat. No, <laughs> Video City, just ignore my fucky wucky and do the thigh. Look at the thighs. That didn't work. There it goes. There we go. Just for reference, this emoji isn't mine. It's from a different VTubers. Yeah, it's not mine uh, either. I don't have any. <laughs> yeah. Yet. Also, it's your turn to read. Oh. I don't know if you read that or not. That's pretty sad. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, this man hits the press. <laughs> Sorry, I'm making everyone gloomy now. No, don't worry about that at all. I'm just wondering if I've got friends I can set you up with. But they all have partners. I know someone who I'm pretty sure is single, but is also kind of crazy, and I like them for it. Riona, that's her name, right? The crazy one, or the this one, Riona, the singer. Yeah. It's the one who got frustrated in here earlier. I don't think it's right yeah. to call them crazy because we barely know them. Right. So they're not your thighs. Got it. No, Video City. Those are anime thighs. Okay. We know you've been like kind of living in like your own world for a while and starting to confuse anime with real life those are 2d my guy or gal you're very kind i'll find some sort of way eventually it's pretty important that i do it's an existential issue for some people 
<laughs> oh, uh, are you and Remy friends or siblings or what? Me and Remy are friends. Yeah. I'm the regrettably older one. I say regrettably because I didn't want to be born. Oh. <laughs> I don't know whether to laugh at that or be sad. <laughs> laugh because I'm fine right now. I was going to make an anime joke, but my brain is losing steam. Friends, for now. Hey, we'll 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 be friends for a while, I'm sure. Yeah. We will help. What can you do? I don't oh really appreciate your offer, Amanda, but even after spending years here, I still struggle with it all. When I first arrived it was hard for me to even hold a conversation. Now I think I can read people a little better, but it's still... Why Remy look or sound sad? Oh, I sound sad, I guess, because I'm, like, sick. Still, also, I'm getting the, the character they were voicing, I think, was kind of... No, they weren't sad. Were they? No. Oh, I think I was saying Silver looks sad. Oh yeah, he probably he is because he's lonely and can't get a, can't get a date. Yeah, and his sister fucking roasted him for it. Yeah, for real, hardcore roasted him, <laughs> like straight up. How do I turn this down? Is this turning it down or up? I can't. That's turning it up. So I need to turn it this way to turn it down. There we go. Now I'm not absolutely screaming. I don't think. I probably am still screaming. I tend to do that a lot. You are not looking for a conversation yet, are you? You wish to connect to ta Fuck. You wish to connect to a hive mind. Oh, okay. I thought Remy is sad. I like to be friends if it's okay. Yeah, sure. We'll be friends, shall we? And you found it easier when you first arrived. Is that not what you said? Yes, that's true, but... We are a hive mind, and we have just arrived here. We will help. It You're using your location? sound reasonable. I suppose social media can be a bit like a hive mind sometimes. Except nobody is connected to anybody and everyone hates each other. All the voices are constantly yeah. screaming. If we were inside of a person's head, it would not be a hive mind. It would be schizophrenia. Okay, Remy, if something hurt you, just get a flamethrower and burn them. <laughs> okay, Drowy. That's a great idea. Do it, Remy. If they hurt you, flamethrower. Purge. <laughs> Man. And there's no harm in trying, right? I don't know. Well, I forgot the conversation, so I feel like I just voiced a super kinky line. And I guess that's settled. Oh, the uh, Amanda is gonna help Silver find a date by reconnecting them okay. to the hive mind or something like that. Got it. show you how the app works when I leave here, man. We are prepared. We will gather intelligence and draw conclusions. With our hive powers and your human knowledge, based on your previous experiences and your new skills, we estimate our odds of success at 100%. I like the confidence. What is confidence? That is just math. Amanda always was a force of nature. We do not know what that means. But it sounds complimentary. Burning things always solves the problem. Or blowing them up. 
Explosions are just burns that are contained and then released rapidly, though everything within its facility no longer exists. Or is torn to shreds. An incendiary grenade is just the cool kid's version of a flamethrower. <laughs> we are pleased. As for... Wait. I'm waiting. What is... We have to go now. But... What happened? Uh, Are you okay, love? I'll explain everything. Sorry, Drac. Uba. See you soon, I hope. We... No time. Let's go. Well, well you did Hey! Okay. <laughs> oh, Shane, you just got robbed. <laughs> they didn't pay their tab. Well, that was... Um... Yeah, that was a rather sudden departure. They didn't... They didn't... They didn't pay. I hope they're going to be alright. What do I feel like the cops about to... Oh, I got I I got him too. Good morning. <laughs> Good evening. Evening, Mister Agent. We two know each other. The agent here has been asking about our customers in the past, but I trust tonight he comes for a late night coffee. Sadly, no. I am here on official business. I'm serious, Agent Smith. It is very serious, Miss... Lua. No, you don't ever uh. give the feds your name. Ever. That's bad. <laughs> yeah. You don't ever give them your name or tell them where anyone went. Yeah. As far as the feds are concerned, you know fuck all. Miss Lua in Drek. You know why I'm here, don't you? Well, if it's not for coffee, honestly, I'm at a loss. Is that how you want to play it? What about you, Miss Lua? Want to make an educated guess? Ah, uh, an educated guess. Is it okay to know where you guys are from? Uh, I am from Tennessee. I'm from pretty much everywhere. I'm very much like lived a nomadic life. That's about as specific as I'm gonna get. I was reading. Well, I swear I followed my tax return months ago. I did bangs at the same time, so that can't be it. I paid all my taxes. I promise. What do you I mean have no clue. for tax evasion? You too. You take me for a fool. Um, do you want my answer to that? Yes, clearly. If you're under my burn, I'm a burn New Jersey. <laughs> Please don't burn New Jersey. It's like a weirder New York. We would never. Let me make myself clear then. There have been alien sightings at this cafe recently. Alien sightings. Sorry, but that does sound kind of far-fetched. Think again. Both of you. Think carefully. I think you could use some oh, time on your this bait bed. Okay, there. Good. I 
hate Lua mainly because of Remy's voice now. Remy's doing an excellent job. Don't be mean. I I can stop if you'd like. I'm no, sorry. we're gonna we're gonna torture Video City for this. Do the voice, but do it more now. <laughs> if I were you, I wouldn't tell any lies. This is getting old. Maybe you and me can go somewhere and do something new. We didn't do anything <laughs> wrong. Just have a little bit of fun. Dear. Still like Remy. I just hate Lua. Lua's cool. He's cool. Cool. We don't have to answer any of your questions, but soon you'll be answering some of mine. Actually? Actually nothing. I know my rights, love. You have no jurisdiction to come here and act like a big shot. Yeah, you came into my shop acting bit. like a dick. I can take you and your lady f little forget everything pin and kick your ass out. I've never seen anyone in this cafe who doesn't belong here, or than you. But one of you ever belonged to anywhere, little man? No, Drowy is not hurting Rim. It is joke. Ha, burn New Jersey. <laughs> I don't know if you can yeah. see that on stream. <laughs> Just his pride. Her pride. So I suggest you take your suspicions elsewhere. And leave this place in Drek alone. My investigation. Your investigation means nothing to us. I can feel myself getting angry, Mr. Agent. And trust me, you don't want me to be angry with you. Remy is a girl. And trust me. You do not want to see me angry. Yeah, she's like from hell or something. Hmm. Hey, don't you dare put your hands on me. I didn't know such thing. Not yet, at least. And I have tools for that. Very well. I'll go for now. This isn't over. I won't stand by quietly while aliens invade Seattle. I love how he moved his seat over because he was terrified. Yeah. Save yourself, dear. You'll only be wasting your time. I'll be the judge of that. Good night to you. Fuck off. I really didn't think I was doing that bad of a voice with Lula, though. You're not. I don't think you are. Honestly, when she... Honestly, I th think she might be a succubus, but I didn't want to say that in case I was just jumping to conclusions, you know? So if that is the case, you're technically doing the perfect voice for her. Yeah. Lua, that was impressive. Well, I may be on the quieter side. But I'm still a succubus. Hey, I was right. <laughs> you were right. We were both right. I'm glad you're my friend and not my enemy. I don't know why I said that in your voice. <laughs> Truth be told, I don't like to antagonize people. Oh, I, mean, I read your line. I'm so sorry. You did earlier. You didn't this time. <laughs> <laughs> Truth be told, I don't like to antagonize people. 
But I guess sometimes I can't be held. Yeah. I wonder what that guy was really after, though. He's a succubus. Just give her 350. That's not okay. <laughs> That's not okay. He's an alien immigrations agent. The AIA. I hate them. He's been after Silver for a while now. Back when Silver was called Neil and looked like Amanda. That doesn't make me like him anymore. It's okay, I don't like him either, for reasons. I came very close to clipping him in his smug face, to be honest. I'm pretty sure that is, in fact, a crime. If I didn't touch him in the end, despite what he thought. No, indeed, you didn't touch him. What do you mean? Seems like an important ID card. Aim if someone were to lose it. Wait, does Drac have fucking psychic powers? <laughs> I'll let you know about the barista after stream, so we don't spoil anything. If you really want to know. Okay. Yeah, I could go with some knowledge. Okay. Would it be a first game knowledge or this game knowledge? First game knowledge. It would bleed yeah. into this game, but first game. Now he doesn't anymore. Naughty Drac, didn't think you had it in you. I'm uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm lying. This certainly is an interesting looking ID card. I'm sure someone creative could find good uses for it. I'm thinking, I'm curious. We do know some creative okay. people. My sentiments exactly. Well, I guess you have some time to consider what to do with <laughs> and who to pass it on to. I think Myrtle. Yeah, or I want to say either could do something with it. Uh, that a big velocity. You don't know my sex life. Indeed. Anyway, this shook me more than I'd like to admit. I'm so sorry. It's really not your fault. But I'm going to go and spend some time with my fiance now. Which will be all of 30 seconds. Video game, honey. Before I start snoring on his shoulder, I read that line and honey woke up and said, We're not fianced yet. Aww. Drag, <laughs> do you have Discord? I do have Discord. I also have Discord. Say hello to him for me. Will do. Yeah, Lua and Bailey. I believe were my first customers in the world, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. I think that's right, because I think Otto went on a freaking, like, rat about how awesome they were. This agent looks like he's going to be trouble. Seemingly important ID card. Give me the link. I... Uh. A fidget spinner and a <laughs> government ID card. What could make a better combo? I like. Oh wait. Here, I'll tell you. I'll show you. Give you this. One. While Drac does that, I'll entertain with a song. 3.14159, this is pi, followed by 
E589 circumference over diameter 7-9 then 323 OMG That's my can't you see <laughs> personal like discord channel is it called channel a uh, discord community like thing channel thing where multiple people oh. hang out I okay. should send you to the welcomes thing yeah are you good with just giving people that from stream or yeah. in stream okay i wasn't Bobby. sure about that weird song i like it Rally says it's the pie song the hundred also, digits of pie Drowy talks like kanaya from homestead a smooth but spicy drought warm and refreshing at the same time I've never seen Homestuck. All right. Or then, God, fucking damn it, Dave. Just lost the last shit. I have a fucking game. Ooh. All right. So, I think that's going to be it for this stream and this video. We're actually 30 minutes over because I lost track of time. <laughs> Oops. Sorry. You're fine. But we did get through another section. Yeah, we got through another section. And now we can start fresh on Friday next time. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna check and see if there's anybody. Great. Now I want pie. We'll go get pie at Videocity. Videocity. Just send me like that. Pumpies. Hey, Videocity. You could either get pie or cake. For reference, I put a picture of pies in the chat. I have ice cream in my fridge. Wait, before yeah, you, you, you go, Vidiosity. Before you go, Vidiosity, were you just saying you didn't like the voice because you actually didn't, or were you just messing around? If it makes you... I'm curious. Oh, okay. I think I got my answer. Oh, that black line is actually there. Okay, cool. There was a there was a black line like right at the edge of my screen, and I didn't know if it was like that. I'm gonna get us to the next day so I can save. Actually, can I save right here? I cannot. And then I will install. So. Atlantic countries to sign multi-billion dollar deal for education system improvement. What returning to the offerings means for Nicomenes. Nicomenes. Woodpecker almost pecks through whole utility pool. Strong beak. Well, I couldn't take the sauciness, but I also want to apologize. I thought you were a guy. It's okay, Vidiosity. I, I appreciate it. Why is there a sex corner in your Discord? Because it's a joke. <laughs> it's not real. I don't ever send anybody there. Alright. Yeah. The rainy season sure is something. Too bad we're gonna have to wait on the rainy season later. If I remember right, it's just a bunch of pictures of cats. No, that's actually like a voice joke. Oh, okay. Sex corner. Okay, yeah. Is that the bottom? There it is. It's like right under, right under chill. Woodpecker? I barely know her. Let me save. All right. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate, like, I appreciate you guys stopping by. And um, I'll see you again on Tuesday, where we're going to be playing Destiny 2. Again. Because that's what I always think. Anyway. Yep. Goodbye. Say goodbye, Remy. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. Wait, you're done? Yeah, we've been going for like two and a half hours. So it's, it's time to be done. Yeah, I know. But, and I will say this since Drowy is new. I stream on Tuesdays, usually when I get home from work, which is between like 5.30, 6 o'clock Eastern Time. For about an hour or so, till about 6.30 to 7 Eastern Time. 
Thursdays I start at 8 p.m. and usually go for about two hours. Fridays, sometimes I stream. That's not a guarantee. Saturdays, I always stream. It's two hours, eight to ten, usually on uh, in Eastern. I fucked that up so badly, but I hope you can discern it. Also, everything... Also, if you want to catch the stream a little earlier, or you want to, like, watch it, watch the entire thing, you can go to my YouTube channel. It'd be Drack the Bat, just like my Twitch channel is. You'll be able to watch this video tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern Time. Anyway, yep. goodbye everyone. Bye.